Hey, my people. So welcome back to part five of why I say don't engage with people. Just block them. Block anybody else that comes from supporting them. Just block them. I'm not recapping anything. Go watch the other videos. So um, a person contacted me and they're like, hey, you're on Instagram and that, right? And I was like, yeah, why? What's wrong? What's up? Because I don't go on there very often. And they're like, you know that that person with the service cats? And I'm like, yeah, go, you need to go check out their, serv their, their page on Instagram. To which I went and checked out their page on Instagram and found pictures of my profile um, where they were asking people for help in finding me. Not only was she trying to find me on that platform, she was trying to find me on three platforms other than TikTok. She had people that were actually going out and running credit checks and stuff on me and finding out exactly where I was at. Because if you know somebody's social media account, you can usually get their name and that goes to spirals from there and you can find out anything you want online if you want to pay for it. And that's what she did. And then those people proceeded to put it all over the internet my name, my marriage history, my credit score in some points, phone number. It was bad. And I'm like, what the hell? And then I started looking through and going through other things that she had posted and found out that she was actively trying to recruit someone to come and pay me a visit and exercise their second amendment right. I had several people that were contacting her said that they had my address and that it would take them a few hours to get there, but they were going to come and take all of our animals and that I would basically never be heard from again. I know of at least three people that she openly online talked about price over, about covering their expenses for the trip. That's a very hard realization to come to. That somebody is so upset about something that you've said to prove them wrong, that they're willing to do anything to make you disappear over it. Every time I saw anything from her, I screenshotted it. All of the people that she was sending after me, everything was getting screenshotted and put in a file. Now I'll do a video about what happened when I called the police, because that was a shit show. That will be the next video. But I did block her and this app unblocked her because her account was banned and then it was restored and that removes all of the blocks and she came at me again. That in another video.